swing. Uh. Breaking Ice is an anthology of short stories written by African American writers and compiled by Terry McMillan. The stories I chose reflected themes of gender, marriage, and the family unit. In the short story I Heard the Doctor Speak by Sandra Flowers, the main character Akila is pulled over for speeding, but she confesses to the murder of a young man. She's then arrested and taken to a psychologist. She doesn't speak for the rest of the story. After a week of therapy, Akila is diagnosed with 60s psychoneurosis. Eventually, Akila is checked in to the psychologist's private hospital. In The Abortion by Alice Walker, the two main characters, Clarence and Amami, are married. They're struggling through an unhappy marriage. They have a son, Clarice. Clarence works for the mayor of the small city and often puts his job before his family. Amami is pregnant, but she has an abortion. She then insists her husband either sleeps in the guest room or gets a vasectomy. Eventually, Clarence gets a vasectomy. In Suitor by Percival Everett, the four main characters make up a family unit. The mother character, referred to as Ma, is thought to be crazy by the rest of the family. Eventually, one of the sons, Craig, hits her over the head with a china bowl. Later, Craig begins collecting dead bird carcasses and storing them in a uh, box in the garage. The other son, Martin, and the dad character find the, the box, assuming it to be mother's, and then Craig begins to doubt his sanity. In Spilled Salt by Barbara Neely, the two main characters, Myrna, the mother, and Kenny, the son, interact after Kenny's just been released from prison after serving a five-year term for rape. He comes to Myrna's house and acts normal. This disturbs Myrna, who avoids Kenny at great length. Myrna still loves Kenny, but even though she loves him, she does not like what he has become. In the end of the story, Myrna leaves a note for Kenny, stating that she will not be returning to the house. In The Shadow of the Peacock by Grace Edwards Yearwood, the main characters, Noel and Frida, are husband and wife. Frida is pregnant. One night, presumably in the middle of a racial killing and race riot, Noel does not come home from work. Frida leaves her apartment to search for Noel. Free Noel is actually coming home late for work. Though there is no clear ending to the story, we can imply that Frida is killed in the riot, and the fate of her unborn child is unknown.